Hey there once again to another video on how to upgrade your laptop. This time we'll be looking at the newest iteration of the most iconic office notebook of all time, the Lenovo ThinkPad L14. We will show you how to open it and how to upgrade the SSD and the RAM of this device. The ThinkPad L14 AMD is a subtle modernization of the classic form factor that has been around since the early 90s. These notebooks are usually built to last and the new L14 version is no exception. It comes as no surprise that the long lifespan of these notebooks comes with a pretty decent upgradability as well. Before you start, make sure that you have all the right parts to open and upgrade the ThinkPad L14. To open it, you will need a normal screwdriver and a guitar pick or a spudger. To upgrade the RAM, get a DDR4 3200MHz module in the SODIM form factor. Ideally, it matches the one already used in the ThinkPad L14. You can check out your RAM clock with the tool hardware info or by opening the ThinkPad and taking a look at the sticker on the side of the RAM module. To replace the SSD, make sure that you get a PCIe 3.0 SSD in the 202080 form factor. The WD Blue SN550 is a decently priced budget option, for example. Before we open up the laptop, do not forget to shut it down completely and separate it from its charger. Also, ground yourself by touching the radiator or another metal structure in your home. You ground it and the cable is off? Then we can finally come to the juicy part of this little operation and loosen the 9 screws on the back cover of the ThinkPad L14. When you've loosened the screws, pry the back cover open with a spudger or guitar pick of your choosing. Don't be surprised that the screws are not coming off entirely, but are rather connected to the back cover. A really cool idea that prevents you from loosing the essential little screws. Fortunately, the ThinkPad L14 isn't as cumbersome to open as some other office notebooks, so you shouldn't have too much of a problem. Before we switch out or upgrade the components, let's take a short tour of the ThinkPads inside. The design of the motherboard is quite clean and easy to understand. This black foil here is covering the two RAM slots and also the LTE module. Next to the LTE module is the network card. Both are also using the PCIe 1 slot and can be replaced at a later date. The battery, seen here, is also not glued in and can be replaced if the need ever arises. So far the ThinkPad L14 gives you every available upgrade option, but one caveat remains. The PCIe SSD sits in the 2.5 inch SSD slot. As there is no SATA connector on the mainboard of the ThinkPad L14 AMD, you can only switch out and upgrade the one and only storage option. All in all, the upgradability of this laptop is still pretty damn good though. Let us start by removing the existing RAM stick. Simply pull up these tiny levers on the sides and pull out the RAM module. Now put your new RAM stick in its place. As most ThinkPads L14 already come equipped with a decent RAM size, the easiest option is to check out which RAM module your version is using and buy the same one for the second RAM slot. Especially AMD Ryzen processors can benefit immensely from a dual channel configuration with two RAM sticks. Now let us go down a bit to the PCIe SSD. Here you simply loosen the single screw holding it in place and replace it with your newly bought model. Make sure that you get an SSD that has the 202080 form factor and runs through the PCIe connector. As this is the sole storage device for your ThinkPad, don't forget to reinstall Windows from a USB stick and download all the necessary ThinkPad drivers from Lenovo's website. Place your new SSD in the connector, press it down gently and tighten the screw to hold it in place. Now put the back cover back on and press it down on all sides, till you hear a satisfying click. Simply close the ThinkPad L14 by tightening the 9 screws on the back cover again. And that's it! We opened up the ThinkPad L14 AMD and replaced its RAM and SSD. I for one really enjoyed it. Hope you did as well and if so, let us know in the comment section down below. Also ring the bell button and subscribe to our channel if you want to know when another upgrade video comes out. We'll surely be back with more English language content for you guys. So stick around and see you soon.